Today in Insane Craft, everyone, we are making a brand new weapon. A weapon that might finally be able to take on the infinity tentacles that are plaguing our lands and take on Sunday once and for all. Hopefully, because today we are crafting the solar sphere. This thing is absolutely broken. If you guys have been absolutely enjoying the content here on Insane Craft, make sure to smash that like button. Get this over 10,000 likes and we'll do another episode. And of course, subscribe if you guys are new to the Piffle channel, please. It helps out a lot. Please enter notification bells on and stuff and dab and let's get on with the episode. That's right, everyone. We are crafting up this solar spear. I still hate that I have to go through my house down here, like through a hole in the wall. I really need to craft a new house. Guys in the comments, comment down below what kind of house you guys want to see. You know, I'm making a trident, so maybe I should make like an Aquaman themed one or something, like Atlantis. Some are really far away from these tentacles. Sometimes these tentacles feel like they're making noises and stuff and it's really creepy. I'm really sick of these stupid tentacles. They're so stupid and ugly and gross. I will be watching you. <laughs> what did What'd you say, tentacles? Uh, okay, you just said that, uh, you know, yeah, nope, 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 nope. I'm sorry, tentacles, you're very nice. I'm sorry, Mwah, love you. Okay, let's get started crafting this uh, solar sphere to just, you know, use on people like sigils and people that don't like the tentacles. Yeah, let's do that. So to craft up the solar sphere, the infinity trident, we're gonna need some items. We're gonna need astral plane analyzers, master forge ingots, and mortality solution. So we have everything but the auroran discs and the astral plane analyzer so we're gonna work on getting the astral plane analyzer but before we do that everyone i want to show you what the trident can do it deals 10 percent true damage and per stack of the shock of an enemy consumes shock on hit so that's gonna be pretty powerful later on when i use my arc zapper on somebody and then i hit him with the trident it's gonna be absolutely broken it's gonna be great let's head on over to the starlit globe wait hold on before i do that i need a synchronizer hold on I need my synchronizer synchronizer there we go yep because we're going to have to complete an epic, and I mean epic, midi game in the Cartographer's Labyrinth. Oh, bro, get off me. You want a piece, bro? What's up, bro? I got a, I got a giant can with your name on it. Okay, you know what? I'm getting I'm getting a little scared. Get away from me. What's up, bro? What's up? What's up? I can rocket jump with this thing. What's up? Okay, I need to make my way down to the bottom layer of this dimension through this labyrinth of dangerous and scariness. Oh my god, I made it through. This place is so freaking dangerous. There's weird creatures trying to kill me at all times. What's up, bro? Get out of here. You get out of here. All of you little weird monsters, get out of here. Welcome, everyone, to the labyrinth of death and demaze and uh, dis despair. This maze? This maze sucks. <laughs> Got him. This is the mini game. I have to take one of these Holotron discs, put it here, and it makes a bunch of random thingies all over the, all the shapes and sizes and gorgeousness of this. And then I have to combine this, I believe. Oh, wait, hold on. So if I do this, it brings them all near me. So if I bring it close to me like that, I have to get all these quadrants, this quadrant on the right, this quadrant over here, a quadrant over there, and over there are all different shapes. So all the triangles in this side and then all the like, squares on this side. Oh my God, this is gonna be impossible. I have to use my big, big brain, way bigger than Sigil's little brain. Look at his brain right there. Look at it, it's small, he has a small brain. All right, so I need to get more items to each other. So I have a bunch of triangles over there. So I need to do this. Remember this, I have to do this while not dying to creatures. Like look at this creature trying to kill me. Get out of here, bro. Yeah, what's up? What's up? That's right. Is there any more creatures trying to kill me? Hello? Get out, hey, get out of here. I'm trying to complete this thing. That doesn't look very easy. I'm about to just like work on a quadrant for like ever. Okay, so I put the squares there, but the, the stars are there. I mean, I got a lot of stars, kind of. I kind of got a lot of stars. I just need to put the stars in the right place. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? You guys know what I'm saying. So I put a star there, a star there. I need to get this star over into a spot where I think it could go. It's just, it's just, it looks more jumbled than it might be lo looking to you. I gotta use my brain. I gotta use 100% of my brain. I need to go Super Saiyan on this thing. One eternity later. I've been at this for about an hour. Yeah, about an hour. And I'll show you how much work I've gotten done. Look at this. It's pretty much almost done. All I gotta do is bring these circles over. Boom, right? And then I gotta bring these triangles up. Boom, boom. And that is a completed, hold on, hold on. Boom, boom. That is a completed board, everybody. Now, all I gotta do after completing this board, right click this and I get myself a brand new item. 
Let's go. The astral plane analyzer. Get out of my way, you weird little creeps. I've been having to hear these guys for over an hour. I want to seek revenge on these things. You thought you guys are funny? Huh? Attacking me at all times? Look how much experience is over here because I've murdered thousands of these things. Who else wants a piece, huh? Who else wants a piece? Huh? All right, we need to go back to our home. We need to go back to our house. We need to figure out what is the next step. So the solar sphere required the astral plane analyzers or whatever. And now we need to get ourselves the Orion disc, the Orodyne. That shouldn't be too difficult, right? <laughs> As long as it's not as difficult as that puzzle was, I'm going to be very happy. So we're going to head on over to the Galaxy Beacon Dimension. But before we do that, everyone, we have to make spike balls. Yep, that's right, everyone. We're going to have to make spiky balls. Spike balls. There it is. A ball with spikes. I look like they could poke an eye out because they probably will. I need razor fangs and slime bedrock, which I have in my Emmy system. So we need to make ourselves a spike ball. We're gonna need a couple of these bad boys. We're gonna need, yep, about a stack should do it. Yep. We have a stack of spike balls that we need to take on over to the galaxy beacon dimension. <laughs> and in this dimension, uh, I'm gonna head on upward, I believe it is. Hold on, where is it? I need to find the area that have, oh, there they are. Yeah, I'm gonna need, let me put this to the side. I need to throw these spike balls at these hanging little, tree line things and then if i hit it just right oh i gotta be careful because that stuff probably can kill me no 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 back ah! oh my god it follows me yo bro watch out watch out bro you don't want none so that should drop oh oh no oh no no no, no. back up bro bro back up this dimension is so terrifying i forgot that this thing is bro bro get out of my face so those things should drop that these little toxic spore samples and in this dimension i'm gonna have to get a bunch of these or I'm gonna die, and I don't wanna die! I did not realize how tough this was gonna be. All right, so I have two, and I'm gonna need like a lot. Ow, ow, it almost killed me. It almost actually killed me. Oh, there we go, there we go. Dude, dude get off me, bro. Ah, ah, get off me. Oh my God. Ah, that's the purple, that's, that's, that's coming from me. Oh my God, oh my God. Okay, 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 we could do this. We could do this. We kill these creatures. Yeah, easy. I cannot wait for my trident. This is gonna be dope. Oh, then I got a bunch of these. Oh, we have 28 already. Oh, we are killing it. This dimension doesn't know what hit it. Oh yeah, oh, oh listen, we can talk. Yeah, get off me. Okay, we're gonna grab the rest of them and then we're gonna head the heck back out of this dimension because this dimension is scary man now that we made it back out of that dimension that terrible 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 dimension we need to get rid of all this junk put the astral plane thing in there put that in there a bunch of toxic spore samples we're looking good so now we're going to use those samples to make chloro wait hold on chloro i can't spell it hold on it's chlor this one it's going to be the chloro divergent solution so we need acid blood and polycharge with toxic spore samples to make a bunch and i mean a metric buttload of chlorodivergent solution. Now that we have this, we have to go back to the galaxy dimension and basically use this in the or divine minds. I didn't say that right, because it's a tough word. All right, so we made it through the mines a little bit and now we're at this security gate that we can only use our security pass level two. If we had a level one, we wouldn't be able to get through this. So good thing I worked on that in the last couple episodes. Oh God. So welcome to the or mines. mines. Ooh, is that acid? I wanna jump in that. Ow, 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 wait, I'm immune. <laughs> it's like taking a nice hot bath, but kind of like not really, you know? Ah, yes, this feels nice. <laughs> I don't know why I'm taking the time to take a bath when I'm trying to make a spear of destruction. You know what, I'm done, I'm done doing that. Okay, listen, so um, the next step that we have to do, let me put this away. We're gonna take the chlorodivergent solution and you see these little ore blocks right here all around. They're not just like any ore block that I could just mine with a pickaxe. Because if I try to, nothing happens, okay? I have to use the chlorodivergent solution on it. And every time I use it, it goes to the nearest block, right? So if I do it again, it goes to that block, right? And if I use it on this one, it probably goes to another block further away. So if I do it on this one, or if I do it on this one, it goes over here. And if I do this one over here, it goes up here. And now there's two. And then if I do it again, boop, and it goes to this one and it goes back to a different one. You basically get it. It goes to every nearest block, which is kind of annoying, but you know what? We do what we got to do. Ow, they hurt. Back up, bro. Oh, I'm going to die. I'm going to die. I succumb to the plague. Is Dean here? 
What? And Sigil said F in the chat. Are you kidding? Are you kidding me? I was trying to mine and be back. I well found the plague. Ha 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 XD ha 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 roar. You know? Okay, we're going back to the dimension. All right, so now that I have two here, I should be able to try to move that up to there, right? So that's two, and I need to use these ones there, and then we're gonna do this one there, and then this one there, and then we're gonna move it over. This is like a weird puzzle that my brain doesn't go, do good with. So, and then over time, they actually end up going away, which is not good for me at all. All right, we got one up to eight. Dude, this is so difficult. This is taking me forever. And these creatures are killing me left, right, and centered. Come on, man. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Give me the Oridine. Give me the Oridine. Oh, we got it. Okay. Oh, we get some more. I can get some more. I can get some more. I can get some more. Yes, 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 yes. Give me this Oridine. Give me this Oridine before it runs out. Come on. Yes, we got it. Okay. We're going to do this a couple more times, everybody. And then we're going to be, well, I think we need like 10 of these things. So... I'm running out of divergent solution. <laughs> and these creatures in here are a little bit toxic. Yep, just a little bit. And I mean a lot of it. Get out of here. I'm not gonna succumb to the plague anymore. You're gonna succumb to my breath. My stinky, stinky breath. <laughs> yeah, take this, you little nerds. Okay, 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 okay. Let's get a couple more and let's craft up the solar spear. All right, we just got back from the dimension. We got 43 Oridines. Hopefully that should be enough, maybe? I don't know, I just hope so. Okay, so now to craft up the solar spear. The infinity trident will be mine and I will take on that weird tentacle creature monster. So to make the solar spear, we needed the Oridine discs, the astral plane analyzers, the master forge ingot and mortality solution. So I need to make Oridine discs real quick by doing this. Hold on, let's get rid of all these real quick. So do this, 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 this. We'll make the Oridine disc. And we're just gonna make a ton of these bad boys. Boop. There we go. Just gonna make literal metric buttload of these bad boys. Boop. And then, boop. And then, oh, I think that should be enough. I hope so. Yeah, that should be enough. All right, so now to make the solar spear. Let's do this thing. That's right, everyone. The astral plane analyzers, the Oridine disc, the master forge ingots, and the mortality solution all together to make an absolutely broken weapon that hopefully will take down Sunday and take down this weird tentacle monster. The solar spear is now mine. Let's take a look at this outside. Hold on, I don't need this disc right now. I had an extra spare. Oh, wait, why am I holding it with two hits? It's a two-headed weapon! Deals 10% true damage per stack of shock on an enemy. Consumes the shock on hit. So that means if I use my Arc Zapper to give someone shock, every percent of that will be 10% true damage, which means I should be able to kill Sunday and Sigils. Sigils is the only one on the server. <laughs> I'm gonna have to kill Sunday later, but now Sigils is about to get my two-headed spear right in the face hole. <laughs> Look at me wiggle. Look at it. I'm jiggling. I'm gyrating. I'm gyrating. Oh, looks like I'm twerking. Look at my little hips. <laughs> All right, let's grab sigils. And let's have some fun. Sigils, I have crafted something amazing. Thank you for joining me here. Thank you. I um, don't like being You here. are one of the only people on the server next to Sunday that I can't seem to kill very often. Don't, I put my hands up. I, my hands are up. My hands <laughs> are literally right, up. Right. You have something like that called was going, that's like all. some sort of elixir of life or something. I don't know what it's called. Um, uh, oh, the guardian elixir. Yeah, 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 yeah. Whatever that's called that basically protects you. Like I can't kill you, right? Like I just, I won't be able to kill you, right? Uh, no, you, you can't, no. So, but I have a new item called the solar spear. The oh, first the two handed heck? weapon added to lost infinity. Look Whoa, at this. that's actually kind of sick. But watch my hips. Watch my hips, ready? Kind of, it look, yeah. Watch my hips. Watch, you're oh, watching my hips? Oh, wow. Yeah, I'm watching your hips. Yeah, watching wow, they're hips. lying. They are oh, lying, right? They are, they are lying, you know what I'm saying? I got All a right. question. I got yeah? a question. Why, why, uh, why is that? That looks like a trident. Everybody knows I'm the trident guy. No, see, the thing is, um, I, I, it's it's for the tentacle monster in terms of like, you know, I can try to whack it, but it doesn't really do it. Yeah, yeah, but I'm the, I'm the trident guy. Uh, so too. Yeah, you were the arc zapper guy, but now look at me. I got an arc zapper in that. Yeah. Yeah, oh, I gave you oh, that. oh, you know what? That makes sense. The arc zapper. I forgot, Sigils. If I put this on you, you don't die, right? Right. No, that won't kill me. Wait, can you stop moving? So you just used it, right? Yeah, yep. <laughs> Goodbye. What? Whoa! <laughs> you just went, oh, God, that was hilarious. Sigils, come back here. Wait, come back you? here. 
Yes. Do you do true damage now? Sigils. So by itself, sigils. Nothing, right? Well, I mean, wait, no, no, actually, it's, wait, no, no, wait, no, I did nothing. Never mind. Yeah, it's it's whatever. It's nothing, right? And but if I use right. this, even though you have the elixir, it just does true damage. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Is your cooldown back? Yep, 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 yep. So you take a sip. Yep, there Goodbye. it goes. Dude. <laughs> Dude, that was my weapon. That was what made me good. <laughs> well, you're not good anymore. Well, you're still pretty good. Now, you remember uh, Sunday also has something like that where over time he just doesn't do it. I can't kill him, right? Unless I have true damage. So I'm going to spam him with about 100 arc sappers and I'm going to hit him with this in the next episode, Sigil. So, you know, I have, an arc, I have the big, big boy arc sapper, yep, right? So I'm going to have you bring the arc sapper, the big boy one. And oh, we're going to have some fun. <laughs> okay. All right. Okay. 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 I like this plan. I, I like this plan. I want to take a bite of one of these little tentacles. No, 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 no. It's bad bite. for you. It's bad for you. No, bite. Bad Come for you. on. I have an ability that lets me use to eat them. Yeah, but it doesn't work. Come on. Let me eat them. No, you go blind. It's not I good. I heard the tentacle monster talk to me before. Yeah, me too. It gives you cavities. All right, so it looks like my new solar spear is absolutely broken and works even through Sigil's amazing infinity powers. So in the next episode, I'm going to be trying this on Sunday. Thanos himself, the tentacle god. Well, maybe maybe the tentacle god. Um, and see if it works on him at the beginning of the next episode. If you guys enjoyed, hit the like button, subscribe if you guys are new here, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Insane Craft. Bye, everybody. <laughs>